Now this edition of my gum out push the envelope, it has to do with the overall weight of the race car. As I told you before, NASCAR mandates a minimum weight overall, also a minimum right side weight. Now why do teams build a car as light as possible if you have to weigh so much? Well, if you build it light, that means you can put the additional weight low and to the left, really helps the handling of the race car. And what we do, and I've got our car jacked up here where I can show you, is that additional weight is in the form of lead, or actually tungsten, which is about three times the weight of lead, and they take that and they put it in the frame rail. Now, if you could possibly move some weight from the right to the left, that would really help the handling of the race car, especially at a flat corner at a short track. Let me show you how a team did that one time. This is the trailing arm cross member. It goes from the right frame rail over to the left frame rail. And they had each end open to the frame rails. And what they did on the right side, they did not have lead. It was not tungsten. It was actually mercury. So once they went through the scales and the race started, the driver threw a pump and it pumped that mercury from the right side to the left side. Really helped the corner of the race car. And what they would do if they ran well enough to be weighed in post-race, the driver would throw the switch again and it would pump it back over to the right side where they'd meet those minimum requirements. Now they never got caught, but something tells me if they had, there would have been a big issue and a big fine. Now, as I've told you many, many times before, this absolutely is between you and me.